very, very special guest. So please join me in welcoming a very warm welcome, Mr. Fuzzy McWallace. It's a pleasure to have you on the show today. Well, thank you very much. It's a pleasure to be here. All right, so Fuzzy, what seems to be the problem? Well, Dr. Nett, I think I'm starting to suffer from a severe case of senioritis. Oh. I know, I know, it's not good. It's not good. Dude, we got to work cut out first today. All right, so what... Excuse me, I forgot my... Here we go. Okay, so uh, when did this start for you? Well, like, it kind of started a little bit freshman year, and then I, and then I came to Amherst sophomore year, and things kind of cooled down, toned down a little bit. And junior year, it started to get back up there. Yeah, I started to feel that, feel them symptoms coming oh. on again. And now this year, I, it's, it's awful. It's out, of, it's out of hand. I'm, I don't do my homework ever. I don't respect the teachers. I don't know what to do. You gotta help me, Dr. Nett. Man, all right, so let me think about this. So let's see. So this, this has been going on after, you're, in a, you're a senior right now. Yes, I am a senior. So this Correct. has been going on younger years. I mean, since maybe elementary school? It's, it's a possibility. I don't really remember back that far. Because, I mean, some of these cases, folks, everywhere, this has been linked to hereditary, like okay. genetics. So, so I can blame my parents. You're, it's, this is this is tough condition, tough condition. So what are some of the symptoms that you're having? Well, like I said, I'm, I'm not doing my homework. I, I'm, I'm showing up late to school. I'm, I'm changing my schedule yeah. so I don't have to take hard classes. I, mean, I, I took as many releases as I could already, and graduation's coming up, and it's not too far away, and I feel like it's years away. It's just years. Oh, I don't know what to do. Ah, dude. All right, all right. So, symptoms you're not doing your homework, none of this stuff. So, you're pretty much a bad student overall. I'm just an awful student right now. You have no idea. You gotta help me, Doctor. Right. You gotta well, help me. I don't know what to do. Well, I would say, you, are you involved in any <laughs> bad behaviors outside of school? I don't think I can uh, say that with the cameras in front of me. Wink, wink. But yeah. let, let, let's just say a couple of my brain cells are gone now. <laughs> I get your point. So, anyway, so uh, well, there's there's been studies, folks, that. Maybe the senioritis, along with hereditary, is linked to just a bad drive. You just don't, you don't care anymore. Lack of you drive. Don't care. Lack of drive, that's it. Don't that's got to be it. But how so, do I fix it then? So, well, let's, let's have a spirit to spirit heart to heart here. So what, what do you think you should do to get over this problem? I, I've been trying to do everything, you know. I've been, I've been trying to do my homework. I bring it home and I look at it and I'm like, Hell no, I'm not doing that. And I just throw it off to the side, and then I watch some Netflix and play some video games. See, that's where first things, that's where it goes wrong. When you open the sack, <laughs> what you do is to be Dr. Nett. Dude, just let him cry it out. We'll be right back after the break. Welcome back, folks. Uh, all you guys are watching those wonderful commercials. Me and Fuzzy here, we got, some, we got another heart to heart in. We finally came up with a solution. 